Hi Soren, this is another video about the hidden feature of window. Let's start it. Going to this PC, on this PC, going to local list C. Some folder and file don't show you. For showing this file and folder, you need to go option menu or a newer item that available on Windows 11 hidden item and click on this part. You can see the folder are now in hidden. You can see some folder, but for better seeing other file of C drive and desktop, going to see more, going to option and view show hidden file and folder if you don't show hidden file and folder select show hidden file folder and write check this box click on yes and click on ok you can see some system folder are now available on c drive if you want to see the background of your picture you can go to the view and display file on icon on time mail. You can go to the view and select display file icon on thumbnails. Display file size information in folder tips. Now you can check this box to don't show the file icon on thumbnail. This is one of useful tricks for a picture that you can see a background of picture or if you want to see a background of picture you can use this item. Now click on OK. Another useful feature that available Windows feature on or off. Some features or windows are not enabled and you must enable this port like Hyper-P and other port that available on this box. This window sandbox are not enabled. For enabling this port, you must go into BIOS and enable virtualization technology. After enabling the virtualization technology, check this box and click on OK. For enabling the virtualization technology, you must reset your PC. Going to Power of Option. Now waiting to restart the PC. During the restart, press Dell or F12 to entering the ASUS motherboard BIOS. Now we came in the BIOS port. If your BIOS are different, you must search on the internet via model number of motherboard or laptop and finding the BIOS key and after restarting, pressing multiple times to enter in the BIOS. Now going to advanced mood on this port or you can use F7 shortcut key. Going to advanced port CPU configuration on this port. CPU configuration. And going and coming to the Intel virtualization technology. If using AMD, you can find the virtual technology of AMD. Is this port, if this port are enabled or disabled, you must pay attention that not disable. For if disable this part, you must enable it. Going to enable and enable this part, and after it, use F10 and save a change and exit. You, you, or you can go to the exit part and use save a change and reset. Before I click on OK. I show you exit menu 
that you can use save a change and reset and click on OK you can see ASUS logo and information about the BIOS key on the bottom of this logo now we came in the windows and virtualization technology of CPU are now enabled going to search menu this part and windows feature on or off turn windows features on or off now you can choose windows sandbox if your windows sandbox not enabled you must first go into BIOS and enable virtualization technology now enable this part and click on OK for last import I came it to Microsoft page Windows Sandbox after reading all instruction and requirement for installing the virtual machine on the machine enable via PowerShell this part you can go to control panel Windows 2 and using PowerShell this part and open it and after it copy this part and this part and the job now finish let's go to test it close all the window now I want to test it Windows Sandbox you can type it Windows Sandbox SR Capital and WR No Capital Windows Sandbox let's check the SPO Windows Sandbox WR Capital and SR No Capital Words Windows Sandbox app now open this app wait to open you can see we have a windows on windows virtual machine on the machine this is a very amazing part and we enable it you can see another drive open this part we have a two windows one here and one here this is windows sandbox thank you for watching this amazing video please consider subscribe for me and suggest my channel to your friend and see my video on playlist and Thank you for commenting my video. I hope that build newer video and better video for you. Thanks all.